So today I'm doing a little Trillmix tutorial on how to make music using new like music blocks. You could also look at Alpha like you know, Logic Guides. They have some stuff about it in the too. Yeah, so today I'm going to show you how to make this. And I'm just this up a little. Let's see if this is any better. So here we have like a simple four second tune. Okay. So the most important thing to start off. Okay, I can't put the tone of these around for a second. So this is like a quick 15 minute project. So here we have every quarter second one of these goes off, which triggers uh, these. These are just like the drums. I just save this. And then I could, you know, silence all these except for all these. Also, we don't need these because I'm using those. But this is like the little drums. Wait, no. <laughs> I've actually made a mistake and I have. So about minus nine. So every fourth these should trigger. Yeah, okay. Seems to be working. Can't be on space. For some reason it automatically puts it on space. And you just get that simple do 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 like those retro games. So what I did next was grab a few of these. I just had them on square and I made a little progression using four of them. So these are all zero. Let me just go around doing this. It's a lot of clicking on these little switches. All right, there's still space. That might have been quite loud. We do now. Now it starts to get interesting. Now we go to five. You get four of them again. Basic music theory, not going to go into it too far. That will be boring. Is it still space? Something? What's going on? Seems about right. That isn't right. That is also not right. And that is also wrong. Still something wrong. <laughs> right, 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 right. Oh, all these are on space, okay. Okay, now you see we get a little progression. Okay, I'm not going to sing because I suck at singing. What you can also do is double up on these, the fourth ones. Again. Automatically goes on space even when copied. What you can also do is instead of these, you can copy the first ones. It should be right. Now these are still on space. Get them off space. They get like a little more of a punch, right? So I went. Another one higher with fifth oh with ten. Is that full? Yeah, 
Yep, that's four. So hook them up. If you want to make it a bit easier on you, you could color them. I'll do that real quick. If I, like, start... Oh, actually... Uh, like these pink. So you can, like, easily see it. Like red. Then... Brighter red. So... Still, the logic is broken, but... Yeah, that, that's pretty broken, if you ask me. The rest, okay. Seems to be... Okay. Cool. Now, I have forgotten one thing, and that's this one. Okay. So now, we have a little, like, three seconds going up we have another second to play with oh well you could have more but i have decided to go with four seconds so really quick i've put in these four which should be back to zero well, that, that's how I like it. Uh, you could go up another notch or anything. You could do anything. That's that's the cool part about this. Now let's color this in purple. Because that's just the color gradient. It's broken. Yes, this one. Yeah. It's just logic and trill makes this pretty broken. Okay, I think it's right now. Space. It's on space. Always, always the case. It's really annoying. I really dislike this. So now you go back down, and then you you could go another notch down or even further up if if you want to, you know. That's basically how I have done it. You you could go even further, because what I also did. Let's add some more logic. Just some more. I'm just using AND gate. You can use whatever logic gate you want, really. Yeah, seems to be right. Okay. Uh, I now what I can do now is. Grab another tone generator, make it the right color. And now I can get a different tone in if I want, which I did triangle, because it sounds nice. So now I can do this, this, okay. put this half of space. And make another little gradient thing that is on for the entire of the time so what i'm doing right now is basically it, like it's very simple but it's going to sound quite good so if i just uh, triangle now i put this to 10 and Hook this up into that one, make the color pink, yay pink, I guess, um, make this purple. Now here comes a little twist, which I'm going to put this on 15, like this one's just going through, which harmonizes it. Sounds quite nice, in my opinion at least. So what happens now is this. are still in space again keep in mind just doing that I made a mistake again okay 
Turns out this is not very easy. That's right, that's right, that's right, that's right, that's right. He's triggering it. No, let's go. It worked. Yeah. <laughs> I might just be deaf. Okay. Is that 15, 10, 5, 0? So this is like a very basic chord progression, right? Oh, I see the problem. Actually. This one is getting triggered by this. That should actually not be triggered or anything. Okay. Come on, why is only the last one like very audible? You can barely hear it, that's kind of weird. Why if we just double up on them? Like, I'm also experimenting right now. It's fun to experiment with the stuff, so... Yeah, you can hear it mostly because it's higher than the rest. We want to keep this so high, I wouldn't know what to do. We could also put it down to zero if we wanted to. Whoa, that was... Which, it, it works. It's not as fun. I guess it's fine. Uh, yeah, there's a few things you can do. You could add another, because um, this is like a part and this is a single part. You can add more of these. So what you could do, what you could do, English, yes, um, is add more. And we're like not going through, like going differently on, like on the same rhythm, basically. Well, differently, <laughs> yeah. English, I, I am very good at English, yes. <laughs> so what you could do is, like, this one and a, a duration of 1.5 or something. And add a different music block. And you could, like, go with saw or something and you could trigger it like this and you make it like uh, it's a higher pitch and make it go progressively lower or something like you can do so many things with this it's really cool now i'm not the king of music theory in any way shape or form just going to add that rule in here because reasons. Okay, now I have to change the delays. This is at there's no space. No space. And also, they're all in the same tone. What if we just go progressively lower? Well, like here, we could do 5, and now we could do 15 again. Like. Da, 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 da. Like, this sounds cool. I would like to make this more of the lead. 
So I am actually going to double and get four of them. Oh, still, it's uh, it's on space again, even though I did not select it that I wanted it to be on space. That's just stupid and annoying and it shouldn't be a thing. So these should not control drums. And now I'm not playing on this very big screen, I just have to aim of a gun. Uh, that sounds pretty cool, right? <laughs> pretty cool. I like it. So, uh, like, you can do infinite things with this. You can make such cool songs, like doo -doo 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 -doo. anything. Anything. Like, you can add such. Oh, I don't know what. Else, I could add. There's so much. I kind of want to double up on the drums. Just get a bit more in there. Because I feel like I can't hear them well enough. And there, I, again. Constantly go back to space, even though I don't want them in space. So the last two of them are getting constantly triggered. Yeah, that seems to be okay. These, okay. Uh, and just to be clear, this is the simplest you can go basically. If you want a simple rhythm, it's just one second. Just one, two, three, four. That's all. That's that's it. And you can make some really cool sounding stuff with it. It sounds like it sounds like those retro games. That's what I like about it mostly. And I think I should make this last note. Um. Like, the entire second. Bit less long? Oh, you can just experiment with this if you want. That's perfect, right? Like, this sounds pretty good for something I've just made in the 18 minutes that I've been recording. This sounds pretty good. And now you can go expand on this really far, right? You can go as far as you want. You can make different calls. You can harmonize different things and stuff. Like what I could do, I, won't, I don't have to go to 15. I could go to 20. I could go to 30. 24 is the highest, okay. <laughs> Two octaves, makes sense. This, this is one octave, uh, minus 12 should be one, and minus 24, and so you have 0, 12, 24, that's the octaves, pretty basic. You could, wait, <laughs> let me just get something and put up this, if I do this, okay, now you can see my face, now I'm going to pull out my earbuds, and I'm going to walk away. I might not be able to hear me very well. This this is like this is a good reference. It's a guitar. Now, why this is a good reference? You begin at zero. I have to put Okay. You you will begin at zero. You, you cannot hear it. <laughs> um maybe if I go like Yeah, okay. And then, if you go to 12... Yeah, you could, it's probably pretty soft, but... No, that's basically it. That, that's, that's the 12 notes. And... Well, 
That's the entirety of this. This is like basically us playing guitar, but different. <laughs> It's only a C, and th that was not a C. That that was an E. So uh, different, but <laughs> not that different. Okay. Um, yeah, that's pretty much going to be it for this video. Um, see you in the next one. I don't know when I'm releasing this, if I'm releasing this or anything, really right now. Um, I'm not putting this up for downloads, but. You, you can pause the video anywhere, really, and see what I am doing. Um, yeah, I'm going to expand further on this. I'm going to make, like, the best song you've ever heard. I'll see you in the next one. See ya.